Help me Hank is tracking trash. Neighbors living near this vacant school on Detroit's east side say illegal dumping is a constant problem. Everything from boats to cars have been dumped at the old Burbank Elementary School near 8 Mile and Hayes. So neighbors called Help Me Hank to help bring attention to the issue, and now things are being done to address it. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester is live there with more tonight. Hank. Kimberly, Jason, good evening to both of you. You know, this is a real danger. There are a lot of kids in this neighborhood. And take a look at all the trash that was just dumped here over the weekend. And investigators also trying to figure out where in the world this car came from. What is this car doing here in this abandoned school parking lot? It's been here for almost two weeks and neighbors are sick of looking at it. It makes it unsafe because when things is not watched and taken care of, it's easy to dump things over here. And within the last week, this old school, the Burbank School on the east side, it's become a dumping ground for people getting rid of their storm related items and debris. Yeah. They throw trash and throw stuff and then they leave and go in their neighborhood and but they bring it over here. This is also the place where not long ago neighbors tipped me off when this boat popped up. It was like heaven when we moved over here. The school was open, all of that kind of stuff, man. And it just kept on deteriorating. With the help of Detroit police, we were able to track down the person who illegally dumped that boat, and they were hit with a ticket and a big fine. How much is this going to set me back? 3500 Oh, man. Now we've alerted police to this new problem, the car, the junk, the debris. The good news is today, the city of Detroit had a team out here mowing the grass, working to clean this area up. But unfortunately, more work needs to be done. The more the neighborhood is kept up, the better the neighborhood is. Back out here live, as for the car itself, investigators have somebody looking into this vehicle. Now, what's strange about it is the license plate was on the vehicle. The VIN number is clearly visible. We know it's registered to somebody in Macomb County. And police right now, what they're trying to do is get that vehicle off the property and figure out who's responsible for dumping it there. We're live here on the east side tonight. Hank Winchester, help me, Hank. Is Hank, have there been concerns about people getting into the school? And Kimberly, there were last year, but if you saw the video of the school, it is pretty secure. It's been mm -hmm. boarded up fairly well, and the good news is that the city does have a team that goes out there once a week to mow the grass, make sure that things are being kept up. But mm -hmm. again, all this debris just popped up after the storms, and now they have to get another crew out here to clean that up. Yeah. Back to you. Okay. Hank, thanks.